Hi everyone, I'm going to share with you how to make another Christmas ornament here. And um, the fabric, I only have two. The right side, I already facing up, okay? Right side, facing right side. The side of the fabric, it's six and a half by six and a half, okay? And I have two. I also using heat and bone tape. You can go to Walmart and it sell on the road. This one is good when you make an ornament. And then you go on to play heat and bone tape on. So when I put it in here, I have a quarter of an inch all around like that. Uh, don't you high heat, okay? <laughs> when you iron this on here. It's very easy to iron. It's better than the, um, the regular interfacing. So use this one and it's perfect when you make an ornament or anything that you want to make it nice and flat so after that you go on to pin this down clip it down whatever you like to do you go on to leave about two inches open so you can inside out so follow the interfacing and so all around don't sew on the interfacing so right on the side everyone after i sew all around and i left it here two inches open so now i'm gonna go and trim the corners when i have the interfacing this way you try it you can see how how easy this is you don't need to zigzag the air, the, the, the side or anything. All I need to do is just leave the paper in here. Last time I make a circle one and I forgot to do this. But leave the paper before you fold in this. Okay, let's fold the side that you left it open like that. So it has something to hold it for you so you can fold it nicely. Like this, okay. And then after that, you can take off the paper. Throw the paper away. Now you can inside out. Remember to do that before you inside out. You still have the paper there. It helps you to fold the side easily. Okay, put all the side out. Use the pencil. Gentle. Remember when you do some project, you make sure you have time to do it. No hurry. No, don't get mad. Just take your time. Everything will be okay. Everyone can do this. If I can do it, everyone can. And I'm not a seamstress. Okay, now you go on to pull out the side like this before you iron it. Now we're going to iron and I'll go show you. When you iron, you're going to be very gentle. Okay, I'm going to hold like this and then go on the side first. I put the iron in here and I pull this a little bit to straight it out like this, okay? That helped me. And then I do this side. And the same time I move the iron. Pull it a little bit, go a little at the time, okay? And now go and out this way. You see? And now it sticks together from the inside, not outside. Okay, go on this side. I am. See how beautiful it is? So easy, it push out the side for you. Very nice. With the side that you left at two inches open right here, you can cut another piece of interfacing. The same length of that one. You can top stitch, but I don't want to have the lie of the sewing. So I'm using this one. And I go on one side of this. I place it in here. Go place it right inside. 
Now when it's inside, go and iron it. Okay. When you iron it in here, you go into the inside here, you go on to peel this paper off. After that, you're gonna iron it. Now you don't have to sew. So simple. So you go in here too. Now it stay together. You see? Alrighty. So now we're going to do something like this. I'm going to pull in this way. But I'm going just to press right here. Right in the middle like that. And I'm going to bring this to the middle like this, okay? And this one right here, bring into the middle too. Make sure the block here, the square right here, is even. Now when you see it even, iron it. You go into turn into this side. When you turn into this side, you're gonna bring this side in to the center right there. Iron. I'm gonna clip it down. And then on this side, I'm gonna do the same thing. Bring it over. I am. Let's flip it down. Okay, now you have this side like this, and this side is like this, okay? The two sides are the same. Now you're going to bring this, this one right here, you're gonna bring into the center. And just clip it down and then bring all this four sides to the center very very easy everyone can do and it's beautiful super easy you can make so many hanging in your tree you see how pretty that is and then on this side Oop, I don't mean to throw that out when you fold you make sure it's pointy and it's like that So easy. Like that. Okay. And then on this side, you go going to do exact the same. Make sure that pointy on the side, pointy on this side. Okay. Now you can see that what we have on this side and this is what we have on this side. Two sides are different. So beautiful. I have to think about it when I... <laughs> When I create this one, and I'm like, I gotta show the, the viewer how to do this. <laughs> so excited. There you go. So now I'm going to take this and iron this down. A lot of people ask me where to get this iron. You can go to Walmart, it's cheaper than that Walmart um, store. Online, they sell it more expensive. I don't, I don't share with you in um, thing that online that more expensive than the store. I know I get commission if you buy, if you purchase something um, online, the, the link that I share with you, but I don't do that. I only share when it's cheaper. Look how beautiful this is. So pretty and both are different. Just two pieces of fabric and it look like this. Okay, so now you're going to add the ribbon on this to um, to her 
hang it up and then something in the middle here you can use the pearl or button it's all up to you or you can use the glue and you go on to glue on together or you can sew it's all up to you everyone there's no wrong or right or anything so everyone i cut the cord right here i got this for 99 cent at my fabric store it is like 100 yards can you believe that it have all different colors too when it's still open i'm gonna go on the side like this and i'm going to place one in just like so not gonna burn me so don't worry i know i know people like ah, ah. you burn yourself and then the other one on the other side and then i'm going to place it in inside just like so like that okay and let it just rest there while it's rest i'm going to add a little bit glue on the bottom in the middle right there as this in as this in a little more as this in hold on to it and then push this in hold on to it okay and then a big one right in the middle for the button to sit on and hold on to everything isn't that so easy there I need my hand I cannot glue my hand out there there you go and then in the other side you see how easy that is super easy look at that I put a lot of glue and then when I push it in you can see that <laughs> It popping up it's so cute and when you do something by accident it turn out so good okay turn on this side this is the other side add the glue right look at my glue or gun everyone you have any glue gun that grows like mine i don't think you do okay ask one in the middle between these two and then ask the button right in the middle push it down just like the other one I'm holding both of them. You see, I when I press it down, the glue is coming up too. <laughs> Cute. All right, that's it, everyone. When I make a short video, can you please support me to watch the video to the end? And um, so that helped me a lot. And also, everyone, the like button is very important to my channel. Make sure you click on the like button if you like our video, everyone. It really helped too. A lot of time people forgot or they don't even know. Even if they like a video, they forgot to click on it. So make sure you click on it for me. Just help me out everyone. And um, just to um, just to touch up a little bit here. On the top of this where the two string, if you don't want it to be like that, then you fold it together like this and then you can get the bead. I get this bead at the Dollar Tree this one with the loose holes and then you put the two two string like that together in one like this okay just like that and then add more to dress up a little bit I like to do that um, fancy okay that's the red white and I'm going to add the green on the top if I oh here we go I just about to say if I can find a green you see how pretty and when you have this green right here you go going to add just a little bit of glue right there you know why so the glue don't I mean the bit don't fall out from the string and that's it it everyone I finished and looks so cute it take you a few minutes a slightly different the way you fold it so it can turn out to two different colors like that. Easy, simple, everyone can do. And then you turn into the other side. It's gonna look like this. So there are two sides. So whatever side you want to um, face out, it's all up to you. Look at that, I tried to make this look nicer, but oh, anyway, it's not a big deal. Um, so just like that. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not and um, Click on the bell button to everyone so every time I upload the video you get notified. Remember the like button, very important for my video. If you uh, click on the like button, it uh, helps my channel a lot. Thank you so much. Love you.